Yes, my beautiful people. So this is already season we're gonna to use to prepare that coconut curry with sweet corn. So we have three sweet corn already right here. We have a piece of fresh thyme. We have half a stalk of spring onion. Then we have some pimento allspice. We have a pinch of salt. We have one and a half tablespoon of coconut powder. We have half a tablespoon of curry powder. We have a half a teaspoon of all purpose season. We have a pinch of garlic powder. We have a pinch of onion powder. And we have two tablespoons of vegetable oil. And we're gonna use some black pepper, just a pinch of black pepper in it. So in Selvin Kitchen, guys, we're gonna look after a beautiful, awesome, delicious recipe in Selvin Kitchen, guys. Yes, my beautiful people, what I'm gonna do now, that's gonna add in the vegetable oil. God, I'm just gonna brown off my curry before. So it's optional. You can use any type of vegetable oil or any type of cooking oil or olive oil for your like, for your taste. So yes, my beautiful people, so I had in the vegetable oil. So right now, I'm just gonna add in the curry. Just gonna make this curry brown off a bit first. Let's give it a couple, one thirty seconds to a minute. Okay, you don't want the curry to start to burn. So I had in my curry there. See the smokes that come out of that curry already. So you turn on your fire. You don't want your fire too high. And then I'm gonna add in my garlic powder. Onion powder. All purpose season. So I had in the coconut powder in this, my beautiful people. What I'm gonna do now, I'm just gonna add some warm water to that. I wanna mix out all of that coconut powder. It's optional, you can use the, the coconut milk, or the coconut bar, but I'm using the coconut powder today, guys. So you're gonna mix out all of that coconut powder. And then after, I'm just gonna pour it in that pot with that curry. Yes, guys, so I'm mixing out this coconut powder. So I don't know why that's going to add a little bit of water to that. I don't run a cup and a half of coconut half water mixed with that coconut milk. So now I'm just going to pour that in that curry over there right now. So the curry is here with the all purpose season, with the garlic powder, with the onion powder. So now it's going to add in the coconut milk in it. Now we're gonna add in the thyme. We're gonna mix all of that combined together. And now, we're gonna have a pinch of salt to it. I'm still gonna taste it later. If I need any more salt, you can add more salt to it. So better you put less salt, more than too much salt in it. Every two minutes, I'm gonna give this a turn. I'm just gonna spin them around. So you want all of that coconut juice to combine with that sweet corn, with that curry. So this is the pimento allspice, guys. So what I'm gonna do now, I'm just gonna crush this, this pimento allspice.
beautiful guys beautiful so I just gonna sprinkle uh, just a little sprinkle of permanent allspice guys guys you know that permanent allspice is quite strong you don't want to put in too much just a little sprinkle and a little touch of black pepper And guys, that is gonna add in a half a teaspoon of brown sugar. A half a teaspoon of brown sugar, guys. Look at that beautiful sweet corn it's cooking on with that coconut milk. Lovely, my beautiful people. Look at that. So me like the sweet corn over there cooking, my beautiful people. What I'm gonna do now? I'm just gonna cut up this spring onion. This green part here, I'm gonna use it for garnish, but this part here is gonna add this in the sweet corn to just give it a nice taste, a nice flavor. So it's gonna add this part in it. It's gonna cut it up fine. So this part here now, I'm gonna keep this one right over here, and then I'm gonna add in this one with that sweet corn to cook down nicely, guys. So let's add in the part of the spring onion. Give that a nice stir. I'm gonna sprinkle all of that curry sauce with that coconut milk over that beautiful sweet corn here, people. It's nice, delicious recipe I'm doing in Selvin Kitchen, guys. I want everything just to come down properly. Corn already cooked already. I just wanted this, this coconut juice with this coconut milk. With this curry powder, everything does cook down nicely. Yes, my beautiful people, this is all finished now, guys. Beautiful, nice, delicious recipe. So you guys can try this recipe. And if you guys try this recipe, you guys can do a little video and send it to me and tell me how this recipe turned out. Oh, well, guys, okay, my beautiful people, this is all finished now. All finished, guys. Look at that. Beautiful recipe, my beautiful people. It's all finished. So yes, my beautiful people, so this is all finished now, guys. I know I'm just gonna dish it out in this plate, my beautiful people. Nice, delicious, sweet corn. You see all of that coconut juice with that curry, everything just cooked down nicely. But you don't want nothing too runny. You want all of that sweet corn to suck up all of that juice. To go right between that sweet corn look at that beautiful my people look at that nice oh yes guys look at that it's all of that juice now i leave over you just pour it right over that sweet corn guys all of that juice in 
right over that sweet corn. Beautiful. Then what we're gonna do now, guys, we're gonna add some of the spring onion. Let's over it for just for garnish, my beautiful people. This is a beautiful recipe. In Selvin Kitchen, guys, you guys can check out this recipe. Tell me what you think about this recipe. Tell me if you guys want to try this recipe. It's a beautiful recipe, guys. So please check it out and tell me what you think. Because when you come on to Selvin Kitchen, guys, look at that, my beautiful people. That is all finished, guys. Look at that. Beautiful. <laughs> 